Hi everyone, so I've just finished getting everything set up in my new home. It's taken me a week to get the whole thing done and I've had loads to do, things to build. I've built loads of furniture, flat pack stuff. But it's now all done. And as you can see, I've got a new sofa. And I've got some new uh, funny cushions. I went and got those from the local town. And I've still got all the cats out before. In fact, I've got them here. This is one that people of mine made me. Um, thanks for that. She made me this last... I think it was October last year, it was either October or November, and um, she made that lovely little cat. So he's going to be sitting there um, soon. I've got the other cats to set up. We've got loads of soft toy cats, if you don't already know. Anyway, so yeah, um, it's all done, and I can finally start getting things back to normal. It's a beautiful new home. Uh, it's really great. I've got everything brand new. So the sofas, the carpets, I've got a new stereo. New fridge freezer, washing machine, new kitchen. Uh, <laughs> what else have I got? New bed. I had to build the bed. That was a bit of a nightmare because the right screws didn't come with it. Uh, there was eight screws missing, so I had to go down the road and pick up some of those. Um, they posted me some, and it was the wrong one still. So I had to go and dash down the road and get those because I couldn't sleep. I had a mattress but no bed. But it's all brand new. Everything in the house, in the toaster, the kettle, everything is completely brand new. And I'll probably never have it this good again where every item in my home is brand new and everything is like under warranty for two years or five years. The only thing not new is my PC, which I should be changing soon because the one I've got was really powerful about six years ago when I first bought it. It was really powerful, but now um, it's really gone, you know, so it's not as strong as it used to be and it's kind of struggling to keep up with some of the video work I've got going on. So anyway, just a quick video for today. Um, I have got quite a few videos made that I'll be releasing very soon. Probably do another one tomorrow or Monday if you're seeing this on the day, the day that it comes out. I've got one about a manoeuvre. Bit of a funny video, but there is an educational purpose to it. One of the um, the longest manoeuvres you'll ever see. I've got one about a funny road sign, which I made about a year ago, and I forgot I've never released that one. So I've got a few videos left that I haven't released before, and I will be filming more from about August, September. So it's taken me a long time to get set up, but my new home is going great. Everything's good. Just got to get the garden sorted. I've got a gardener coming around this afternoon to have a look at that. And yeah, he's going to sort that out for me. It's all good. Um, for the first time, I've actually got a garden and I never really bothered before about this. Whenever I used to live in flats, it never bothered me. I used to say I wouldn't want a garden. But it's great having one. You know, I think there hasn't been a day gone by so far when I haven't gone home from work and just be gone and sat out in the garden on the bench. It's so nice to be able to sit outside and not have to just keep walking up and down the road and not have anywhere to sit. So yeah, I'm working on my videos. I feel much more settled here than I ever did before. Feels like home straight away. Doesn't feel unusual. I haven't got to travel miles and miles like I did in my last place. It's taking me... I was doing about... Is it six, let's say five miles a day to make it easy. Five miles each way extra. So it's five there, five back on the first lesson. Five there, five back on the second lesson. 20 miles a day extra. And it doesn't sound a lot. People say, well, it's only five miles. But I have to do it there, back, there, back every day. So that was 20 miles a day on a six day week. That, that's uh, what, 120 miles a week. Roughly 480 a month roughly five and a half thousand ish extra miles a year and it was a lot of extra traveling that's you know one of the main thing i hated about the last place i lived in now i'm actually closer to everyone than i used to be and the great news is my car insurance has gone down by 100 pounds a year which is weird because when you move home normally they always just say oh that area is not as bad not as good as the last one it's worse you'd have to pay extra but my car insurance has gone right down because this area it's got a very low crime rate. It's a really nice, nice quiet area. As you can hear, there's no, no sound, not like where I was before. There's no noise and constant buses flying past the window and cars screaming past. It was, that last place was terrible. I really didn't enjoy living there at all. This one is nice and peaceful and quiet. So yeah, just keep you all up to date. That's what, what I've been doing, what's been going on. Uh, so now I'm just going to go and do another lesson I shall be working on a few videos this evening. By the time you watch this, I'll probably have made another one or two. And I keep saying I've got hundreds and hundreds of clips 
on my PC. So there'll be loads of videos coming out where it's just a video, maybe one or two minutes long, something to do with driving, lots and lots of different points where I'll film things happening, things going wrong. Just got tons and tons of those to release. So there will be more videos coming, more longer videos as well. Uh, but yeah, hope you appreciate. It's a big thing moving home. It's probably one of the biggest things you ever do. It's incredibly stressful, but I've just got everything sorted and I'm really starting to enjoy living here. So thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon for more videos.